Burton. Oh no, he held on it too long. Nemhard away! Got it, baby! Got it! The rookie out of Gonzaga! <laughs> yeah. hits Never underestimate the Lakers' ability to blow a big lead. It was almost like they were trying to give this game away. I mean, my goodness. They were up 17 at the beginning of the fourth, and the team was playing really well. Anthony Davis was playing like he has been the past few games, and yet they still threw it away. They leave guys open on a regular. They forgot what era they play in. You can't just leave guys open and expect them to miss shots. In today's NBA, everybody can hit threes. Everybody. You can never leave guys open. And the Lakers do it every other play. And not to mention the careless turnovers. Not only do the Lakers turn over the ball way too much, it looks like high school level turnovers. Dribbling off the foot, horrible passes, double dribbles, traveling on stupid plays when they have big leads. Once the Lakers get a big lead, it's like they don't even care. And they start playing like the Harlem Globetrotters, just throwing around whatever, shooting whatever, it doesn't matter anymore. Even the commentators for the Indiana Pacers knew their team was going to come back. They weren't scared one bit. Even when their team was down 17, they said, ah, they'll let us come back. We're not worried. How embarrassing is that? With a team that has LeBron James, Anthony Davis, Russell Westbrook, and a decent cast. These guys aren't bad. Lonnie Walker played well. Dennis Schroeder played well. Austin Reeves plays well. This team isn't a championship contender, but they're good enough to not give up these stupid games in the regular season, especially when you're at home against a young team. Why don't they have any pride? This is a team full of rookies, and they just handed them the game on a silver platter. This was an embarrassing performance by the Lakers. I know we shouldn't be surprised, but every time it gets worse, no matter how big the lead gets and how little time is on the clock, the Lakers find a way to lose. Like always, I want to hear from you guys in the comments section down below. What do you think of Nemhard's game winner and the Lakers blowing yet another big lead? And leave a like if you enjoyed this video and subscribe for more NBA content just like this. And I'll see you in the next one.